Welcome to Lavelle Play Tours Projects with a Purpose. You know how sometimes you have to reuse a document over and over and over again. So what you might do is go find the old document and then go back through and change the information and then save it. There is a much faster way to do that. So here's a sample invoice uh, that I use whenever I am doing a training. So my client is John Doe, and then I also left a message, the next class we're going to do VLOOKUP, conditional formatting and format cells. Now I have a new client who is Jane Smith. So if I didn't know how to do this process, I'm getting ready to show you. Here's what would happen. I'm going to close this. I'm going to open up Microsoft Excel and I'm like, oh, what was that? last invoice that I use so what I would have to do is search for it so here's John Doe right here but what I want to do is show you where you're going to find this once we do the process once we convert this invoice into a template it'll be just a few seconds to find and create a new invoice let me show you where templates are located I'm going to click on new and then these are the built-in templates that are available to you. But what I want to do is save it into my personal area. Okay, so let me go back to open. So here is John Doe, my previous invoice. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to go in and remove the information that I'm going to be changing most often. I'm going to be changing the client's name. I'm going to be changing the date. I'm going to change the date in here. Uh, my rate will still be the same, um, but I can always change the type of training. And then also this one, um, it may be Word or PowerPoint, so I'm going to delete that out. And then also in this area, in um, a18 this information changes okay so let me see make sure i'm good to go okay my date will change the type of training i provide will change the customer will change the date will change my rate is always the same for an hour training and then this will this uh will change as the customer's activities progress all right now here's the cool thing that i'm going to do i'm going to go to file I'm going to go to save as and then over here in my documents area I'm just going to take out John Doe and the thing is it's not going to save in my documents it's going to save in a special area where templates are housed okay so now I'm going to click on where it says Excel workbook and what I'm going to do I'm going to choose Excel template and see how it changes automatically it's not going to save it in my document it's going to go into my templates okay I'm going to go ahead and hit save and I'm going to close this now when I go to Excel and I open it up and I'm in my backstage view when I go to new and I go to personal see how it's sitting here and I just uh, tap it and open it and then I'm able to use it over and over and over again thank you for watching please subscribe if you have any comments or questions, please put them in the comment area. I look forward to seeing you in the next training. Have an amazing day.